All right, guys, today we have a Madden 19 award loyalty program, which is actually pretty interesting, and we're going to get right into it. Before we get into it, though, we have comment today coming in from Mr. MT, and he said, Ryan Kerrigan got very disrespected with his rating. I believe Ryan Kerrigan's rating was like an 89 or something, but nonetheless, guys, we have a question of the day, and it's going to be, what's your opinion of this loyalty program, and if you had to choose any of these five players to start off Madden 19, who would they be and why? Like goal for this video, guys. Can we smash 75 likes? Let's go ahead and get right into it. Before I get right into it, though, I do have a second channel, that Zom Gamer, T H A T Z O M Gamer, and I am uploading daily content on that channel. So if you could go ahead and hit that subscribe button on that channel too and support me over there, I very much appreciate it. I am doing daily uploads of different gameplays over there. So if you like my content, you most likely like it over there too. So this is what we have in front of us. Now, what is this? We have Zach Brown, Glover Quinn, Demarcus Lawrence, Jimmy Graham, and Brandon Cooks. Well, what this is, guys, is this going to go ahead and be one of five players you get to choose from if you just played Madden this year. Now, how they're working this is that if you played 16, Madden 16, 17, and 18, you get to choose three of the five players. If you played 17 and 18, you get to choose two players. And if you only played 18, you only get to choose one. So depending on how long you have played Madden NFL, you get to go ahead and choose that amount of players. So for example, they're only going back to 16. I wish they went back to the very beginning because a lot of us, I know there's a lot of people in the comment section, myself included, we've been playing Madden since 01. So we would have been like going crazy getting all the players. But with that in mind, it's only three or five, even if you played the maximum three years. So right here it says get uh, max three fantasy packs and three elite totals, which these are all 83 overall players. If you go ahead and play it all three years, if you play two, you get two of these. If you play one, you get one of these. So that is the beginning of the loyalty program. Depending on how long you have played, you do get rewarded for your loyalty of playing Madden NFL, uh, NFL in general. So 16, 17, 18. So how the Madden 19 loyalty program works. If you logged into your EA account over the last three years, now this is actually really important, and I'm going to stop waiting for a second to explain this. If you go to Madden right now, so if you're watching this video, go into Madden, go to your settings, and go to EA account. That email you see right there is your EA account email. That has to have logged in the last three years into Madden, 16, 17, and 18. So just keep that in mind. That is what they're saying. If your EA account... Over the last three years, play Madden. If you logged into those games, you can go ahead and you receive these awards. Now, real fast, I want to say a little trick that I don't know if EA is going to let you do it, and I don't know if it's going to work, but it might be worth a try. If this is your first year, and you have 16 or 17, or let's say a friend has 16 or 17, it might not be a bad idea to maybe borrow that copy of that game log into that game Madden 16 or 17 with your EA account just in case they let you be able to do that and still get a free 83 of all elite because if your friend has 16 and 17 because he's a football junkie you could possibly get all three of the five players or three of the five players from just logging in right now so again if you you know it's worth a try do not spend money to get a copy of Madden 16 or 17 but it's worth a try if you just want to see hey let me see if this will work. And you might it might work and you might get a free player. That would be awesome, right? So that's the little trick I was thinking about that might end up working. Um, Madden 19 with the same EA account. You see the content. It doesn't get much easier than that. One of it matters where you played Madden over the last three years. So it didn't matter if you played different consoles. So because e the EA account is universal, meaning you can log in your EA account on Xbox, on a PS4, on a whatever console you play on 360 ps3 uh, it doesn't matter you can log into any single console you want over the ea account of the last three years and it will transfer over to the new madden now the thing is i wonder is i'm wondering if they're going to go ahead and actually uh transfer this over to pc this is something that i know that the rookie premier player rookie premier players 
are not going ahead and transferring over to PC from Xbox and that's why I told you guys this morning in my video this morning I'm not I'm gonna be playing Xbox and PC because my players don't transfer over and I'm kind of ticked off about that so with that in mind that's why I am playing both consoles oh well PC is not a console but console and PC um, that's why I'm playing both because I want to go ahead and get my awards and my players um, so with that in mind you know I'm wondering if this transfers over I'm really hoping it does because I don't see why it wouldn't I'm literally logging into Madden on my PC from my EA account but I'm not sure how that's gonna work it says this is a cross-platform deal too if you switch consoles and played 16 on PlayStation 17 and 18 on Xbox all previous game titles will be counted so I'm guessing it will count but we'll have to wait and see what are the three years of mad three tiers of Madden 19 loyalty rewards based on your gameplay tied to EA count now it says based on your gameplay so I'm guessing you do have to play games on those three game oh you have to play games on those three games say that ten times fast um, and I'm guessing that's what it means by that uh, nonetheless going ahead and skipping past a lot of this stuff it's pretty much just not, not important stuff for us right so month 18 and month 19 so this is a month 18 loyalty reward program we had one token two token three six seven and ten and this one is going to be one token gets you a small quick sell pack two tokens get you either a offensive uh, silver player pack or a defensive silver player pack four tokens get you an offensive gold player pack or a defense gold player pack eight tokens get you an offensive elite player or defense elite player so if you played all 10 weeks of the nfl replay objective list you will start off Madden 19 with a guaranteed offense or defense of elite player pack which is really awesome because you're guaranteed 10 elite to oh, 10 loyalty tokens now with that in mind i'm gonna take a hundred percent guess here but I'm going to pretty much co confirm this 99.99999% that you will be getting uh, loyalty tokens for Mutt Master, Ultimate Master, all that kind of good stuff. Because last year, I remember they gave us like 10 tokens for doing Mutt Master, and they gave us like 5 for doing Ultimate Master. So I expect the same thing to happen in Mutt 19, where we get actually even more tokens for doing Mutt and Ultimate Master. Probably also solo challenges, you go probably get tokens for and just overall playing the game logging in doing your daily quick sell stuff like that you probably will get tokens for so in reality wise you should if you did everything this year ultimate mutt master everything you should at least be able to get two of these so maybe one offense one defense elite player pack now last year i gotta say that these packs are glitchy as all heck because last year i did one um this is actually this wasn't last year this was this was for this year for the loyalty promo uh, for the um, e replay, the sets added to the game. This wasn't the beginning of last year loyalty promo. But uh, when it comes to this year, though, I got a defense elite player pack. I got Cam Chancellor day one, who was an 88 overall, going for like 500,000 coins. So I'm not kidding, guys. You can really pull gold out of these packs. So. I'm excited about that. I can't wait to start live streaming, showing you guys Madden 19. Again, guys, August 2nd at 12 a.m., I will be live streaming Madden 19. And I saw someone comment down below and tell me, like, hey, what was, um, why aren't you live streaming as much anymore? I told you guys, I will be live streaming almost every day when Madden 19 releases. Obviously, I'm not live streaming right now because Madden 18 is kind of dead. Uh, but I will be live streaming once month 19 does release. And again, if I had to rank these players from worst to best, worst to best, again, trying to improve my speech impediment. I appreciate all you guys who said, like, don't worry about your speech impediment. We still love you. I appreciate that very much. But I do want to try to improve it for people who are, there are some people who are nice about it and say, hey, you should improve this. And I am trying my best to improve it. So you're going to see sometimes when I speak, I try my best to correct myself and say the word correctly. Um, Brandon Cooks, I would go at number one. Number two, I go with Jimmy Graham. Number three, I go with Zach Brown. Number four, I go with Demarcus Lawrence. And then number five, I go with Glover Quinn. Now, going over these players, the reason why I rank them in that order is because you want a fast wide receiver, you want a good quality tight end, you want a good user, and then you want to worry about your pass rush and you want to worry about your secondary. How there's a motto when it comes to football where you work from the outside in. 
and that's how I feel like Madden 19 is going to be. So, for example, you want to look at the wide receivers and then all the way in. So the tight end next, then the running back, then the quarterback. That's how I feel like Madden 19 is going to be. And that's how, based on playing it, that's what I feel like. Um, when it comes to the defense, it's completely opposite. <laughs> the defense is the opposite of out. It's the inside out. So you start at the linemen, go to linebackers, go to the secondary. That's how I feel like Madden 19 will be. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe button. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.